And this is exactly what we want to protect. Biological girls being able to fairly compete against other biological girls in the sports they love. The Protection in Women in Sports Act passed the House with a 219 to 203 vote. And I don't care how many surgeries you have, I don't care how many chemicals you put into your body, you're not going to be a biological woman. House Democrats push back on the bill. This is a creepy bill. The only way to enforce this bill is to empower school officials to inspect the genitals of kids. This is Republican culture wars going into our classrooms from Washington, D.C. There are already rules and there are already organizations who are taking the lead on this. Female Republicans called the bill important to protect young female athletes. Young girls are being exposed to male genitalia and have to undress themselves and expose their own bodies to these biological males. The bill would still allow transgender girls to train and practice with female sports teams, so long as the athlete's participation does not prevent a biological female athlete from being included on the roster. The legislation comes as 21 states already have laws in place banning transgender athletes from participating in sports aligning with their gender identity. If passed, the legislation would amend Title IX, which is a comprehensive law enacted nationwide prohibiting discrimination based on sex. Let's stop distorting reality. It's beyond disgusting, and I cannot believe that we are subjecting girls to this kind of exploitation. Makes me sick to my stomach. Even if the bill were to pass the Democratic-led Senate, it doesn't have a bright future, as President Joe Biden has already threatened to block the measure. From the Capitol, I'm Amy DeLora for Washington Examiner.